Hi everybody. Today, I'm going to swap my old toilet for a new one. I'm going to replace it with this toilet. It's a total toilet. You shouldn't use a toilet like this. You get your feet wet. Now, most of you are smart and will hire plumbers to do this, but since I'm not that smart, I'm going to do it myself. I'm really going to screw this up. Why well, am I holding an axe? Good question. You may be wondering why I'm I want to replace this old toilet with a new one. Well, when the original contractors installed this toilet, they installed it at a slant. Now, you really can't see from that position, but when we look up from above, you can see it's not lined up to this line on the bottom. I was pointing a little to the left. I don't know why the contractor did that. Maybe he got punched in the eye or something when he was installing this, or he was being attacked. But regardless, I'm going to take this toilet out, put a new one in, and hopefully I can straighten it out. I hate The line that I goes to the right of it a little. Shower to the left, bring it out a little. This job just escalated. Oh, so, I'm guessing the first thing you need to do is empty the toilet from the excess water. Ah, I don't want to touch that water, it's so nasty. Ah, ah, you need it. Small bucket and a bigger bucket. <laughs> ah, this is nasty. Oh, I dropped water on the ground. I'm going to burn this all up. <laughs> well, good thing that this is a flushometer, so when I take it apart, I don't have to off the water supply since the water is being stopped over here. I don't have to worry about much water coming out. Just gotta take this thing off and then remove the toilet. This thing attached to the toilet, I gotta remove that too. And now we deadlift. Hello, this is Robot AC21 coming to you with another proverb to enlighten your mind. He is a good friend who applauds me from behind. What kind of friend is that? Don't they know you have the clapper installed and if they applaud, the lights will keep going on and off. How rude is that? You may even think your place is haunted and then what? You can't fight a ghost with a stick and bird's seeds, like how you would fight a dragon. The stick will be completely useless. And have you ever gotten into a fist fight with a ghost? It's like hitting math in the face. So what I want to do is I want to dry fit the toilet to see where how it lines up. Hello, this is Robot AC21 coming to you with. Hold up, didn't I already give you a proverb? Do you really want to hear another one? Because I don't want to. They don't make sense. They say things that mean other things. And when you finally are able to decipher it and tell people, they just look at you like you just ate the chair they were sitting on. Fine. If you really want a proverb, here you go. Fart noise. It doesn't line up. You see? It's off. It doesn't line up. It goes to the right of it a little. 
I'm gonna move the flashometer to the left, bring it out a little. This job just escalated.